Today, I'm gonna show you how to set up a gaming stream on StreamYard. Step number one is to go to StreamYard.com and sign up for an account. Consider using my affiliate link in the description. After all, one creator to the next, trying to help you here. Then what we wanna do here is we wanna click on a live stream or a live recording. I would first advise just doing recordings, that way you can get good at this before just jumping straight into live streaming. So click on recording here and then title it. Let's name this gameplay. 2000 create recording and this is going to bring us into the studio next what we want to do is make sure we have our cameras and all the settings set up with the right camera and the microphone i highly advise you get yourself a decent microphone it's a huge huge deal you'll be able to see if your mic is working right here then click on enter studio. All right, so now that we are in the studio, next what we wanna do here is we wanna add our camera here. And again, I have multiple webcams here, so I'll try not to get too confused here. Here, I'll just move my face over the camera. All right, so next then what we need to do here is we have our camera working in the studio, right? And we can tell that the microphone is working. To test all this, go down to the settings tab and just make sure that we have everything figured out. Choose your camera, choose your camera resolution. And again, guys, you're not gonna be able to get 4K recordings without signing up for StreamYard, their pro version, which is probably gonna be a huge deal with gaming because you want decent quality footage, right? Then the audio here, you can choose all this, you can test it, you can do virtual backgrounds, etc., etc. All right, so now that we have all that figured out, next what we can do here is go down to the present tab because we need to bring up our game, right? Then we need to click on, there's a couple settings here. There's slides, extra camera, video file, click on share screen. Then from here, you need to choose which screen your game is on. Is it in a Chrome tab? Is it in a window? Or do you just wanna record the entire screen on your desktop? I suggest choosing the window of the specific game you're doing. I'm just using this game as an example, so I'm just gonna open this, and again, it's just in another tab here. And again, this is just a corny game from crazygames.com. I'm just using this as an example. Then go back to the tab of StreamYard and you can see this is what is showing up or going to be seen, right? And you can choose from the different layouts. I prefer this layout where it moves it like this and it has my screen in the lower left-hand corner or right-hand corner, you can move that and change it. And again, what's really cool is you can actually invite other gamers. Say if you were adding other gamers, you could invite people and just give them this link and it will send it to them and they can join. And then it will also bring their camera here if you guys are playing the same exact game and you guys can all be talking and record it all. It's Actually really cool but like I said you need that pro version of StreamYard to be doing like 1080 or 4k recordings and again consider signing up with StreamYard using my affiliate link links will be in the description I know I'm done selling on you so this is essentially what the gameplay is going to look like and all you have to do is click record in the right hand corner or it'll say go live if you're gonna do a live stream and this layout is completely the same if you're doing a video recording or a live stream I personally would probably do the recordings because then you could put it in a video editor and then edit it after in case there's like dead spots or mistakes or etc. But there also is a cool feature of just going live. What's really cool here is if like people start commenting and someone comments, you can actually highlight it and have it go in the stream itself. Then you can do custom banners. Like if I do this, it says rank my gameplay. You could put something in here where people to try to get them to comment in the chat, etc. And again, you can connect this to your Twitch too, which is really cool. You can add a bunch of brandability. You can do custom overlays. You can put your logo on it. You know, a lot of people put their logo on their gameplay so other people aren't stealing their stuff, but that's totally up to you. Then there's a private chat if you have moderators, admins, etc., where you don't want people seeing like what you're saying. That's like behind closed doors. And again, you could just switch between gameplay. Like if I just wanted my camera, I could switch to this. You know, if you had something to say during gameplay and you wanted your face cam, or if you just want it like this, it's totally up to you. Let me change that banner. There's other settings too. You could do this one. You could do that one, that one. There's a bunch of different ones here. So all you do is click record and go live. Some pieces of advice. Um, I've done, I have 10 YouTube channels and I've done pretty much all of this. My advice to you is to make sure you have a decent plan to where you're recording decent uh, quality footage because the free plan is 720p, which is complete garbage if we're being honest. Second, to use the recording feature, and just re what you can do is record the actual gameplay in here and then you can edit it and make it look a lot different and then maybe after that you do the pre-recorded feature where you can go live with a video using StreamYard. That is what I would personally do or you can just go for it and go live. Like if you don't care, there's kind of like a raw version to that that like a lot of people appreciate as well. Maybe I'm just a little nervous of actually being live, but that's also the cool part of it, right? Like that's the goal. Another piece of advice is you're going to figure out that your computer it may struggle with this because you're recording this and it's really gonna test your computer. Just letting you know. If you have a weak computer, this is really gonna test it. So let's do some gameplay. Um, let's put this here. 
Let's put it here. And if I'm recording, you'll see it up here. And then when you're done recording, that's all you do is click stop. And then that's when the recording goes back to the dashboard. And it kind of looks like this. And if you click on the library tab, that's where it's going to be over here. Or it'll come up right here and you can get in there and edit it. You can click right here and download it, etc. So that's how to do gaming streaming on StreamYard. Maybe you're looking to game with friends or you're just looking to record your gameplay using StreamYard. It does it all. Again, consider signing up with StreamYard using my affiliate link in the description. Hit me up in the comments. What kind of games are you going to be playing? What's your goal? How many players, etc. Um, this stuff really kind of like interests me to hear from you. Consider subscribing and I'll see you in the next one, guys.